in front of the Art Museum itself. You've got a blockage there. Also, JFK Boulevard affected between 30th and 20th Street, as is 16th Street between JFK Boulevard, Arch, and Ben Franklin Parkway. Next update in less than 10 minutes. I'm Eric Kerr, the KYW News Radio 24 Hour Traffic Center. Don't put it off another minute. Drive into your Jiffy Loop for the preventive maintenance your vehicle needs today. Turn into the Jiffy Loop nearest you and leave worry behind. No appointment necessary. This is Dr. Weather Meteorologist Elliot Abrams for today. Thanksgiving Day, plenty of sunshine and pleasant high 57. Clear and cold tonight. Low 32 in outlying areas to 39 in Center City. Are quite mild with tides of clouds and sunshine high 60. Saturday, windy and chillier with intervals of clouds and sunshine high 46. A few snow flurries might be seen well north and west of the city. Sunday, partly sunny, brisk and chilly high 44. Monday, mostly sunny high 49. That's AccuWeather on KYW News Radio. 42, partly sunny on Independence Mall. 37 at the airport, heading up to 57. At our Orthopedic and Spine Institute at Abington and Lansdale Hospitals, we're using mini incision surgery for joints of the spine so people can get back to living. See real life stories about our power to heal at abingtonpowertoheal.org. KYW News Time 7:55. Now the KYW Business Report. Here's Bob Manning of Morgan Stanley Smith Barney. It's Thanksgiving Day on Wall Street. Investors enjoying a well-deserved rest before tomorrow's holiday-shortened day of trading. The fiscal cliff has been the dominant force dictating trading since Election Day, bringing with it the concern of its impact if Congress fails, and with that concern, an increase in volatility. Today, in some locations, is also the kickoff of holiday shopping season, an early kickoff ahead of the traditional Black Friday sales bonanza. Look for Wall Street to remain focused and continue its headline-driven fiscal cliff trading. From Morgan Stanley Wealth Management, I'm Tom Manning for KYW News Radio. Business reports on KYW News Radio at 25 and 55 after every hour. They don't wear a big white chef's hat, but they're still quick to offer advice on how to cook the Thanksgiving turkey. They're junior chefs in Mrs. Golden's kindergarten. So exactly what it takes to begin cooking the Thanksgiving turkey to perfection. You stab it and you cut it in half. Now, time for the oven. Put it in the oven for 20 hours. Then to the dinner. Bird goes with some apples. And rice crispies, treats, and brownies. When it's time to wait, young folks know precisely what they like the most. The chicken. What part of the chicken do you like the best? The bones. Stephen Kaufman, CBS News, okay. The police officer was taken to the hospital after being involved in a two-car crash in southwest Philadelphia. Police say it happened at 84th and Lindbergh Boulevard around 9.30 last night. An officer with the Accident Investigation Department says the officer was going west on Lindbergh and a minivan was going south on 84th when they crashed at the intersection. Authorities say both the officer and the other driver complained of pain and were taken to the hospital of the University of Pennsylvania, both listed in stable condition. 43 and partly sunny on the mall, 37 at the airport heading up to 57. KYW News Time, 7.57. A new backyard deck, a finished basement, a remodeled kitchen. Over the years, you've updated your home. But have you updated your home insurance?